here at the Old Bethel ME Church. They're not messing around. They knew it uh, was old, so they said it's the old church. Erected and then rebuilt first in 1818 and then 1867. We'll go back around the front and look at that plaque. But what a cool building here on the uh, East Lake, sorry, East Fork State Park property. There is an East Fork Lake, of course. But man, this is beautifully manicured, this property. There's probably cameras up on the light post. Otherwise, I can't imagine people wouldn't come out here and do vandalism, which is just unbelievable. They do have no conscience anymore, but there's some old gravestones, ones that look like they've cracked, and so they've kind of leaned them against the building. Wow. It has an original window in there, that's kind of protecting it. Of course, you can't see anything inside. Very, very old building. Wow, wow, wow. Looks like the glass is missing from in there, but again, you just can't see anything. Here's the cemetery. Very quiet property, which is a welcome relief. They have mowed this and maintained this impeccably. Some very old headstones, a lot of decay, a lot of erosion. And I put the bug spray on because I knew it's gonna be terrible around here. And yeah, look at these, I mean, they're tipped over. Uh, it's like 1820. My God. Unbelievable. Uh. He was 18. <sighs> Unbelievable. I mean, these are very, very old headstones. I can imagine this is one eerie place at dark. Eighteen forty two. Unbelievable. This is mostly a pre Civil War cemetery. Hard to believe. Beautiful property. There's the church. Really, really nice afternoon. It's been a long time since I've done videos again and uh, I don't know, kind of a trip. I just really lost the love for filming stuff. It wasn't just everything going on in the world, but just I uh, kind of lost the passion for videoing, photography, uh, pho photography or anything. Just, there was no point anymore. I wasn't getting any benefit from it and just didn't feel like I wanted to do it. So thought I'd, I wanted to do something here. See if I still had any kind of love for it. We won't uh, stay here too long, make the video that long or anything, but uh, look at this. This tree. Wow. Unbelievable. 
quite uh, picturesque. It's grown up practically right on the headstone. And the vines. Wow. So, I don't know my tree, some kind of pine tree. Like, I'm thinking it could be a beech tree. It could be, these could be beech trees. Beech wood, yeah. These are very old trees. Really, really cool. <clears throat> I'll go back outside the fence and take a look at the other side of the church and look at the uh, plaque. Amazing maintenance here. So whoever's mowing and weed whacking everything takes some serious pride. State parks are always like this. This is not a forgotten place. They don't really have a clasp. Actually, they do. It doesn't seem like it's it's too far away from the post. I can't do this. I guess that's got to work. Current church dates to 1860, uh, 70, uh, 67, wow. Sure would be cool to see inside. Uh, power meter on it. Kind of odd. What if they do some kind of like programs in there at some point? Kind of odd to see a pretty new power meter on there. It's in very nice shape. Amazing. So that's gonna do it. Thank you so much for coming along. Beautiful afternoon here in uh, the greater Cincinnati area, Claremont County. Walk back over here. Yeah. There's pre-Civil War and definitely Civil War veterans in here as well. Oh man, what a trip. So there you go. The Old Bethel Methodist Church.